Namaskar. Many of you have uh, asked me that you were telling uh, so many words and you have written so many books. We want to know more about uh, your uh, personal life and uh, about you. Uh, yeah, for all those uh, people and for all those friends who want to know more about me, uh, I am trying to give you uh, my small introduction. My name is Dr. Keshav Chandra Mondal. I uh, was born in a municipality town of Nodia district in the state of West Bengal. And uh, the name of my uh, town is Birnagar municipality, Birnagar. And uh, it is a very old municipal uh, area. It is also a very historic, important, historic place. So, um, at first I will start uh, with my skills. Research skills mainly I would like to share with you. I have completed two research studies from India's two renowned government institutions. First, my PhD degree from Vidyashagur University and the second one um, is from Indian Council of Social Science Research, New Delhi. Since last two decades, I have been conducting empirical research as well as desktop research. I am an expert in formulating hypotheses, preparing scientific questionnaire, making proper sample size, conducting field survey in multicultural areas and data interpretation process. Yes, in regard to my writing scale, I would like to say that uh, I am uh, an expert in writing, editing, proofreading and designing book or any research project and in regard to my interactive skills it is little advanced i have strong networks in various social media platforms such as linkedin twitter email facebook whatsapp etc i have been attending seminars and conferences and visiting formal and informal meetings and functions that give me an extra mileage to reach the readers, scholars, customers, publishers, and other authors of different fields. Strong drafting knowledge in English language and fluency in English make easier to reach the audience in the whole world. My lecture videos and postings on social media platforms make my followers updated about my present and upcoming events. And in regard to my computer skill, I would like to say that I have learned computer from NIIT in the year 1997. The branch was in Noida at the time I was living, staying in Noida in the state of Uttar Pradesh, India. I learned advanced knowledge of MS Word, Excel, Macros, Pivot Tables, Data Visualization, and I'm proficient in PowerPoint also. And uh, my educational background uh, starts started from uh, Birnagar High School, that is my native town. I passed from there twelfth examination, and from there, I, after passing my twelfth examination, I got admission in Chakda College in nineteen hundred and in nineteen eighty five. 
and I took honors in political science. I had two elective subjects, English and history. In 1988, after passing from Chagda College, I got admission in Kolani University. From Kolani University, I completed my master degree in the year 19, 1990. But the result came out in the January of 1991. After that, I enrolled in a management institution in Kolkata. But without completing that, I went to Delhi for for job, and I got an offer from a reputed public limited company. And I worked there for about nine years. Then I came back to India in 1999 or 2000. From 2000 to 2001, June, I worked um, in another private limited company in Kolkata. And then I got a teaching job in Ghatal YSS Vidapit. It is a higher secondary school. I started teaching there political science since June 2001. And then I took Exam West Bengal, uh, uh, what I say, education departments, one headmasters. Uh, for, I applied for headmasters job because at the time my daughter already ad, already uh, got admission in Jadavpur University, so I thought that we should sh I should shift from. Uh, from, from Ghatal to Kolkata and I got selected and I have started working as uh, the headmaster of SM Nagar Dirojio Sriti Vidyalaya. It is a high school uh, in the district of uh, South 24 Pargonas but it falls in Kolkata 143. While I was working in Ghatal YSS Vidapit, I enrolled in 2003 at Vidyashagor University and I completed my PhD, my PhD dissertation was Empowerment of Women and Panchayati Raj the perception and reality a case study in Midnapur. After that, I enrolled myself in, in another university and I thought that I would uh, study English literature and from Madurai Kamraj University, I completed another MA in English from 2007 to 2009. And uh, once again, from Madurai Kamraj University, I completed my another MA in political science. In 2006. In the meantime, I completed my B.Ed. That means Bachelor of Education from Panchkura College under Vidyashagur University. And uh, in 1997, I completed MBA. And that is not MBA. That is PGDBM means post-graduation 
diploma in business management. Uh, it was, I had uh, done this from uh, Management Studies Promotion Institution, New Delhi. And then I, uh, what is same? Then I, at the same time, I was uh, doing research simultaneously. I was doing research and writing books and articles and I was uh, editing a, 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 a newspaper titled, it was Dashila Bhoti and uh, at the same time I was also doing um, what is a uh, working as um, honorary editor of uh, a of a of an e magazine it was uh, published from kerala spirituality and politics and uh, and this uh, i have completed a research project i told earlier that i completed a research project from indian council of social science research from 2015 to 2017 and uh, I submitted the project report also there and uh, I have already published uh, several books these include first I, I mean I, I am starting from the latest one gender empowerment in local governments prospects and debates of sustainable development in India it was published in 2009. In 2018, last year, I published Mamata Banerjee, the maker of New Bengal. In 2014, that means before coming to Kolkata, I wrote one Bengali book that, uh, I mean, in Bengali, uh, I wrote Ghatal Pauru Shabha Unnayan O Kichu Kotham. My another book, The Thoughts of an Unknown Indian, was published from Scholars Press, Germany, in 2014. Another book was published in the preceding year, that is in 2013. Uh, it was Barack Obama, The Harbinger of Peace and Prosperity. In 2012, I published two book, one book, Gender and Empowerment, a Comparative Analysis of India and USA. Then in 2010, I published two books, very important books. One was my PhD thesis, converted into a book. The name was a little bit changed, Empowerment of Women and Panchayati Raj. Experiences from West Bengal, one. Another is West Bengal government, the issues and constraints of development. I conducted a survey in four states, four different districts in this state and uh, predicted that the left front government is uh, going to fall. And that happened in 2011. Then, I, in 2009, I published a book of poems. The name of the book was Poetry, The Mirror of Society. In 2008, I wrote West Bengal, colon, Problems and Prospects. My 11th book was first book, A Panorama of Ghatal. It was a tribute to the place where I worked a lot. And my 12th book, Sustainable Development in India, a comparison with the G20 
it's in the press it will be published maybe within one or two months i have uh, membership of different professional institutions i'm a life member of west bengal political science association formerly i was a member of uh, jadavpur association of international relations voluntary service i worked i gave voluntary service to the international red cross society of india in ghatal branch i have attended many seminars and presented papers in 2009 paper a paper presented at the state level seminar on empowerment of women through panchayati raj system in india it was organized by association of voluntary Asso agencies for rural development west bengal state unit camp office 1 by 1 college square kolkata 7000 17 it was held on 28th february 2009 another national seminar on civil society democracy and thought of jp means joy prakash narayan held at joy prakash narayan rural research center dashpur pashchim medinipur west bengal in the seminar a paper titled rights of women with special references to slum dwellers was presented by me on 11th october 2009 another paper was presented on 12th annual conference of west bengal political science association it was held at surendranath college shialda indian government and politics another paper discrimination against women a global phenomenon this paper was presented at ugc sponsored two day national seminar on gender budgeting a step towards justice it was held between march 17 and 18 in 2011 at ghatal rovindra shatobarshiki mahavidyalaya in collaboration with chandrakana vidyasagar mahavidyalaya i was invited to present paper titled gender empowerment in local governments myth and reality the indian scenario at the third international conference on women studies organized by the center for research in social sciences and humanities creative medium and communications research limited 95 wide lane l s27 8 db leeds united kingdom date 13th and 14th may 2017 Another paper was presented on the occasion of 18th annual conference of West Bengal Political Science Association the title was gender equality in local governments In this way I had submitted many papers in many seminars and conferences I have published I mean two monographs are are there Panchayati Raj Pratishthan in Bengali Mohila der Khomotayoner Shopan in Bengali It was edited by Amit Roy uh, He teaches in Ghatal Shatobarshiki Mahavidyalaya and uh, It was published in Antarjatik Parshala, edited by Dr. Amit Roy. Probably he has done a PhD. 
doctorate or may not be and another monograph titled gender discrimination a global phenomenon in gender budgeting a step towards justice conceptual and empirical issues it was edited by dr abdul mutin it was published by dash gupta and company private limited kolkata you can sign this you can see this article in uh, page number 163 to 178 of the book and i have published some articles in foreign journals also my articles have been published from canada from ukraine and from other countries in national journals also i have many articles not only that i have written almost four dozens of articles in various newspapers and magazines that's all i it was a lengthy video i would like to i do not like to i mean uh, stretch more it will be really boring for you however i try to give you a small description about me thank you thank you very much